According to sources Janet Jackson is pushing back against a lawsuit that claims her businesses are responsible for a $200,000 bill. Court documents obtained reveal that Jackson is seeking the dismissal of all allegations made against her multiple companies. Earlier this year Creditors Adjustment Bureau, a collections company, filed a civil lawsuit against Janet Jackson and her multiple businesses. The lawsuit targeted Jackson personally, as well as her company's Black Doll Incorporation, Juggernaut Productions, Rhythm Nation, JDJ Entertainment, and Queendom Incorporation. According to the lawsuit, Janet Jackson was allegedly in debt to her former business managers at Negro Carlin Siegel Feldstein and Bolno for a sum of $238,593.88. The firm specializes in business management, royalty, tax, and audit services for high-achieving individuals such as top artists and athletes, as stated on their website. The debt was subsequently assigned to Creditors Adjustment Bureau, which then pursued legal action against Jackson. Janet Jackson's attorney, Ronald Richards who is known for his exceptional legal skills, refuted the alleged debt. Richards told that they have been working with a former manager who referred the disputed bill to collections. He added that the matter had already been resolved years ago, owing to some errors that were made in Mr. Jackson's account. Richards also mentioned that the claim is past the statute of limitations and that the suing party will be in for a surprise, as the debt was resolved before the firm was bought out. Jackson has yet to respond to the lawsuit personally but has filed a response on behalf of her companies. Jackson's companies deny all allegations of wrongdoing. Richards argued creditors adjustment bureau lacked standing to bring the lawsuit. What are your thoughts? Like share and comments and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.